How's it going, everybody? And I got thrills to seek, deaths to defy, mattress tags to tear off. Welcome, everybody. This is Thorn with the Game Design Lexicon. Sorry, somebody just messaged me on uh, on Discord, and I was wondering what it said. I'll uh, worry about responding to it in a bit. But um, welcome. I hope everybody's Thursday is going okay. It is Thursday, August twenty second, on this hot ass day in 2024 here and down in Houston, Texas. Um, we're playing some Fallout, a tale of two wastelands today. That is Fallout 3, Fallout New Vegas, all the DLC for both. All in the Fallout New Vegas engine. It's really interesting being able to play the Fallout 3 gear uh, with uh, the New Vegas setup. Uh, it looks like I'm going to be traveling to New Vegas soon. And I'm pretty sure I've uh, almost maxed out the level of my character, which means uh, we're probably going to have an interesting game once I get there. So that was my... Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I remember where I was. Um, Quick saving, even though I just loaded. How about that? So we were underneath the town. We were looking for... Um, let's see, there was supposed to be a nest of death claws down here. Looks like our mission is pushing us up there somewhere, so. Um, let's check out over here. Looks like there is a passageway over there, so let's, let's, uh, circle around back that way. Let's see if, uh, going over here nets us anything. Let's see, we got mangled people. Mangled stuff, all uh, green as can be. I'm guessing it's dark as hell in here. Otherwise, why would I have my uh, night vision on, right? Dude, I, I'm still wearing the medic armor. Boy, shit's heavy, dude. Oh yeah, it is kind of dark in here. I'll keep those on. And oh my god, the medic armor. The fuck uses even that? I should drop it off next time I'm at the uh, base. It shan't be long. Oh man, of course I start uh, streaming. First thing that happens is I start getting messages left and right. Um, gonna ignore them. Hey, Talion, how's it going? Uh, in the next section, uh, DLC or side quest. Um, hey, Bad Gal Beach, thank you for the follow and welcome to the stream, Talion. To answer your question for, I believe you were asking what weapon I settled on, on uh, in Unepic. And I do believe the one that I was using the most was the spear, if I'm not mistaken. Um, so right now, uh, as far as, um, as far as Fallout goes, ooh, there's a sniper rifle stash back here. Um, I am so I've I'm I'm post uh, final mission so I've 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 resolved the entire uh, storyline, um, save my dead, um, save the world or whatever the hell was going on in this thing and right now I'm doing the missions that they do after that they literally give you after you've resolved the entire game. Um, I'm torn between continuing to do this and then ju or just. Uh, saying fuck it and going over to Vegas so um, right now I'm in a hole in the ground that has a bunch of death claws see there's there's one of the bastards over there but uh, welcome to the stream uh, bad gal beach um, I hope uh, your Thursday is going okay same with you Talion Yeah, it's gonna be quite the uh, quite the show when I head over to Vegas. I'm I'm like I said, I think I'm almost maxed out on my level, and um, it's gonna make for an interesting game. Okay, shit, I didn't go over there. This is probably the right way too. What do we got here? Oh, gun cabinet. Oh, oh, an anti-material rifle. That's gonna be heavy as hell. Yeah, we'll take it anyway. Uh, up. Oh, wait a second. Oh. Shit, I guess up is the right way. Um, shitski. I wonder why my, um, my little alert didn't go off when that person subscribed. 
That makes me so upset that it doesn't work sometimes. Like sometimes somebody subscribes and it just doesn't do anything. And it's, it's truly, truly upsetting. Um. Okay, so let's go over here. Since I don't think we've mapped out this area and I want to be thorough. It's, um, where is it over here? Yeah, I think I like the spear in an epic because I think I like the reach that it gave you. Um, it was either that <clears throat> or the sword because of, I think, the damage. Luckily, since I've played it recently, I have a little bit of a memory of, of what I did in those. Yeah, the reach was really nice because, like, uh, I think the big one was, like, the snakes. What the hell? Um, you could actually peg the sta snakes without, um, without getting hit by them at all. So, what the hell? Oh, okay. Well, that's why that's not mapped. Yeah, the snakes used to piss me off. And, uh, I like the fact that you could, uh, pop them with a spear without getting within range of them. Sword was really good for the bats, though. I think the spear was really shitty for the bats. Uh, bats, i.e. another one of the mobs that pissed me off beyond belief. Um, what is this? Locked average. Well, that's not going to keep me out. So, I mean, it certainly doesn't hurt to have a, at least a couple weapons that have, you know, decent purposes. Um, and then past that, I think, uh, for big damage, it was always magic, right? Once, once you start getting the magic in the game. Ooh, let's back y'all. Couple dead people. A med kit. Yeah, I kind of wish I had uh, stuck with it and uh, played the rest of it. Oh man, that's too heavy. I need to stop picking up shit because I'm going to be weighed down soon. Yeah, you keep with it, and it should be a it should be a pretty pretty lasting uh, series. Um, there's a weight advantage there. Sad part is I don't think I. Oh, what am I doing with a goddamn missile launcher, dude? That is gone. Okay, well that eliminated a decent amount of weight. Screw that missile launcher. Why the hell does? I think it gave me the missile launcher because it's like okay, well he's gonna be facing some death claws. And he's down in Deathclawville. Wasting away in Deathclawville. Um, but, uh... I guess, um, my little pistol's doing okay against him, you know? Yeah, I'm sure I'll, I'll get back to Unepic again. Um, I definitely want to play through it, I just... For some reason, I think I put it in as like a filler game for a day that I didn't have anything to play and then uh, just kind of passed back on it. Um, a lot of games I didn't mind like showcasing just like a day's worth of play and I think that was just one of them. Uh, now I kind of have a de dedicated day for that and I'm trying to pick games that are more appropriate and then save the games that uh, take a long time. Old only S. Wilson building. You say so. Whoa. Get to the chopper. Get to the chopper. Why is there a helicopter going on around here? Scusa. Oh, shit, it's bright out here, huh? Should probably take off them eye things. Well, this place is all screwed up, dude. How is this place even still standing? That's my question. Whoa. Enclave Hellfire Trooper. Well, that calls for this gun. Gear up, soldier. Shit, missed him. But that guy's pissed now. Damn it. Son of a bitch. Where did, where did he go? Okay. Shit. 
Why, why do I suddenly suck? Oh, because it's been like two weeks since I played this damn game. Wow. These guys are sure taking it. I don't really even see that I'm damaging them. Which is... Oh, there he is. Floppy floppy. Getting back up. Yeah, definitely not. Okay, well, um, now that I know you guys are there, let's get a little closer so I can agitate you. Oh, shit, dude. There he goes. Hey, head crippled. Gotta love it when you cripple a head. Is he not getting up? Doesn't look like he's getting up. Can't say as I blame him after taking that. Ow, you son of a bitch. Why did that not hit him? Shit, now I can't see that guy at all. Oh, son of a bitch. I need to get a better angle. By the way, I love this gun. And the ammo that I get for it is only going up. Like, so I can't use the ammo fast enough to, like burn through this gun. Um, also, the helicopter guys, really? The helicopter? Oh, this looks like a stair going to kind of where I need to go. Let's use it. Now, oh, there we go. That's the better angle we needed. Oh, shit, dude. Everything just went wonky there for a sec. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I see somebody. Is he gonna Is he gonna see me? That's the question. Where's he going? Oh, it's that Hellfire Trooper. Shit, where the hell is he going? That's a good question. And oh my god, that helicopter, dude. Really? Oh. Damn it. Ugh. Remember, squeeze, don't jerk. When you when you pull the trigger, just squeeze. If you jerk it, you'll you'll jerk your aim. That's what they tell you. Come on, get that whatever it is. Oh cram, my favorite. It's like spam but not like off-brand spam. Can you just imagine off-brand spam? Oh my god. I don't even want to imagine that. Um, you know where spam comes from, too? You want to know a fun story about spam? It's actually a fun story about a lot of uh, processed food like that, so... What the hell? Another one is... Um, oh, god damn it. Oh, shit! He saw me, and he fired at me. Um, Vegemite's another one that kind of follows this. Uh, oh, stop hitting the jump, dude. So, at one point in time, these uh, companies were trying to supplement stuff uh, due to wartime rationing, right? And, and keep us healthy and eating the right stuff. And where'd he go? So, they would invent uh, food that would uh, keep really well um, from products that we had plenty of. And uh, one of them was we had uh, more ham than beef. So, and of course, they didn't have, like, real ham, or I, I guess it is real ham, but the problem is it's, of course, an amalgamation made from a bunch of parts from uh, pigs that, you know, normally weren't used. It's all processed, right? So, anything that they could... Uh, process up, fit into a can. Why am I not hitting this guy? This is pissing me off. Okay, and there's another one. Shit, and they're hitting the hell out of me, dude. So, same with uh, Vegemite. Vegemite was uh, produced by Kraft, and it was easily storable, had a really high shelf life, and on top of that, it was extremely high in vitamin B complex. 
and it was you know it was made specifically for uh, soldiers and um, and populations that needed food that uh, you know needed supplementing because they had uh, they didn't have enough uh, other nutrition so they uh, made this it was easy to make it was uh, what the hell was a uh, Vegemite I remember reading at one point in time what it was made from it's like something highly processed and, and whatever. So, and the reason why um, people in Australia love Vegemite is because, of course, uh, Kraft gave it away for free during, I think, World War II um, to supplement their diet. Did that guy die? It's hard to see. And so now everybody loves it there. Well, I mean, not everybody loves it there. Obviously, there has to be some people that can't stand Vegemite. Yeah, I mean, we got something similar here, Marmite, but I think Marmite's made differently. I'd have to relook it up to, to remember, but... Yeah. So, and same same story with Spam. Um, again, process ham bits that they could... Um, that's the dude's heavy incinerator. They could give to the population easy enough. Man, this thing's breaking. I've been using this gun and that stupid sniper rifle so much that I can't keep them repaired. I don't know if I want to go in there yet. Is that where I'm supposed to be going? Um, shit, that is, actually. Okay, fine. I won't explore then. What? So, helicopter in one place. Shocky things in this place. Oh, open the door. Don't jump, you dopey. What's this? Probably should get my uh, Googles back on. I think uh, I think there's probably similar stories behind a lot of some of the staples of our food too, like American cheese, for example. I think American cheese was originally made as a processed food during wartime. What is this? Um, first, where is it in? Very hard, requires key. Okay, well, um, guess I'm not getting in there anytime soon. So what do we got in here? Oh, oh, we got robot. Is he a bad robot? He's a bad robot. hit me once. Whoa. Those things are smoking. What? Excuse me. I hear you. I don't see you. Oh, there you are. Look how many times I can shoot them on, on one set of AP. Let some AP regenerate. Well, we got plenty of shots, so why don't we just do this manually, huh? Why bother with that? What were you doing hiding in here, you little bastard? Oh, look at all this. There's some of those lovely uh, five millimeter rounds that we can't use for anything. Oh, I love the ability to hop. So I've been playing. Um, been playing some Morrowind via the open Morrowind uh, engine, which is is absolutely fantastic. If you've never played Morrowind and you're always interested in playing it, but couldn't get over the the old ass interface and the fact that it was just an old ass game, uh, try open Morrowind. It's really awesome. Um, anyway, uh, one of the downsides is, uh, and this is like. All games like this, I guess. I, well, I don't know. I don't know. So more when, um, when you're like walking around some of the places, like the hallways are like unbelievably narrow, and you can't get around the people in it. 
So, and there's really no proper, I mean, there is a jump in the game, but it's not really a proper jump. And so, like, getting around people in narrow hallways is, like, fucking impossible. And goddamn annoying. So I spend a lot of time, like, uh, like, casting levitate so I can get over people. Which is good, because I guess it, um, what is all this going on over here? This is... Oh, I didn't want that. God damn it. Okay. Normally I don't put stuff back. But holy hell, dude. Ooh, an intact garden gnome? Why the hell am I carrying that around? Nuka Cola truck. No, nah, it's kind of worth it. Maybe I should keep that intact garden gnome. God damn it. I hate myself. Do 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 So, um As far as uh like work goes, I, I've been having this thought lately and I don't know if I'm gonna follow through on it, but apparently uh Amazon um uh, has a marketplace where you can um read audiobooks for people. So I was thinking about maybe getting voiceover work or freelance voiceover work doing that stuff. Uh, looking into maybe doing it. I don't know. I don't know what's uh, involved. Oh. Stick your head back up, you bastard. Oh, come on. I know you're still alive. I can see your hit points. And I hate this suit of armor, by the way. Where the fuck did he go? He, like, ducked out. Dude, everything is smoking. Yeah, it's pretty weird. I guess starting in, uh, I'm, I want to say Oblivion. Um, they made the game a little bit more dynamic to where you can jump over people and shit. I'm all over the place today. Wrench? Yeah, nah. Smoking. Whoa. Oh, a metro ticket. I will take your metro ticket and raise you... Um, oh shit, there's a lot of metro tickets. What? What? Are these... I wonder what type of metro ticket these are. That was weird. It looked like a house of cards, but it wasn't. It was a house of metro tickets. And um, how much do these weigh? Nothing? Okay, well, no harm, no foul. Oh, what the hell? Oh, God. Oh, God. Don't do that. Okay. So, oh, what the hell did I just take? God damn it, dude. I could have swore it was a fucking, um, archive surprise voucher. Oh, it was a carton of cigarettes, wasn't it? Bitch, that's what it was. Okay, why do I have a Stradivarius? I'm walking around with a fucking violin, dude. Okay. Well, um, if that's... Oh, my God. I killed this guy in the optimal place, didn't I? Yeah. Oh, you can walk through him. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. It's radiated in here. Advanced radiation suit. It's still radiated in here. Active emitter. Oh shit, dude. So that radiated the shit out of me. I'm now at 740 rads. Whoa, Wunderbar. Um, rat away? Right? Guess I should have took some rad X. 
Oh, that's the first time I've had to um, chug a bunch of rat away. Yeah, um, well, at least we know where all the buzzing was coming from. What? What? Oh shit, I didn't see that guy. Shit. Well, that was harrowing. I don't know why I didn't see that second guy. That kind of sucked. Um... So, yeah, rather than just putting on the rad suit, I should have, um... Should have taken, taken some rad stuff. Thank you. Please drive through. Um... So, what's this? Lock hard. So... I'm at a loss as to what all this shite is. Uh, apparently the Enclave guys were interested in it. Uh oh, another door? Lock hard. Oh shit, I hear a turret somewhere. I think it's locked hard, but I could get into it with no problem. So, what saw me? Probably another one of them robots. Robots? Okay. Oh. He coming through the door. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit, they locked me in. They locked me in with them. What am I gonna do now? I'm pretty screwed. <laughs> Um. Oh shit, I dropped one. I didn't mean to drop it. Well, thank god I had a couple frag grenades laying around. What? Arrow? I don't know. That was interesting. I don't even know what the hell this is, dude. I don't even remember this part in the game. Like, it's so far into the game that there's no way I could possibly remember this shit. That must have been the turrets I heard, too. I'm imagining. Activate emergency electrical switch. Done and done. Oh my god, more zap, 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 zap. Any bad stuff? seen anything, but oh my god, dude, what is that? That's like the... That's like the most awesome plasma sphere I've ever seen. I want, I want that on my disc. Scotch. Yeah. Nothing good on the shelves. Oh, shit. Oh. And that is a break. This storm with game design lexicon. And I've been so enthralled by this game, I've been neglecting my coffee. <laughs> We're going to take a short break here. If you do like our content, make sure you give us a follow down below here on Twitch. We do stream Monday through Friday, noon p.m. to 3 p.m. Central Standard Time. Um, and if you want to watch any of our older content, you can do that over on YouTube where we put it over there, usually about a week after the fact. Typically, anyway, our music for the day is Rough Cut. If you don't recognize them, the guitarist is Jakey Lee. That's Ozzy Osbourne's guitarist during Bark on the Moon. And um, the lead singer is the lead singer that was with uh, Quiet Riot for one album, which I think I've played on here. Anyway, um, I'll be back after the short break, and uh, I'll see you in a couple.